The Judgment Day is here. And the WWE Universe will feel their wrath. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing The Judgment Day. From Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn Balor. Each member of the Judgment Day has been successful in their own right, but together, they might be unstoppable. No brand, no division is safe from the wrath of Judgment Day. Yeah, and here's the scary thing. Others are starting to believe the lies the Judgment Day are spouting. Somehow this superstar's got to find a way to just shut things down for AJ Styles. Shut down his total offensive repertoire if he hopes to come out of here with a win. The original, the official, the only club that matters. More championships among the three than most of the locker room combined. And his opponent, representing the OC from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ Styles. Hard to think of three men as feared and revered as the OC. And they've got a completely new focus since returning and reuniting. This man is taking aim at the Prince. Guys, he better not miss. Yeah, it takes a lot of guts to step up to a competitor like Finn Balor. But a win could change his career. Two fan favorites here in AJ Styles and Finn Balor, a dream match that has a lot of hype to live up to. These are two of the best in-ring competitors of our generation about to do battle. This is pure competition, folks. Both AJ Styles and Finn Balor really made names for themselves wrestling in Japan. At one point in their career, they both led the same faction. Well, put it all in perspective, this match has global meetings around the world. Voice up their opponent, looking for Burning Hammer. Boom. Bam. Down he goes. He's one step ahead there. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Ducks under, Pele kick, nicely done. There are many reasons why AJ Styles has been at the top of sports entertainment for so long. How do you formulate a game plan when going up against a superstar like Styles? Well, a lot of AJ's offense starts with his lower body, Cole. No, no, no! Clean shot sent on to the outside. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Sight set on the top rope. His eyes are fixated. He's looking. Lift off. Close line. Hoping to end it here. Stopping the refs count at two. And you got to think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Expected that one. He must have had that scouting. No! 
backbreaker. Uh-oh. Look for the suplex. No, uh -oh. no, no. Neck breaker. Ooh. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. Oh. Balor's lost momentum here. Finn is being worked on heavily. And it's Balor, who looks like he's a little worse for wear after that hit. When Styles gets on the attack like that, you don't want none. Setting him up for something here. Both superstars perched up high. Not from up there. Here he goes for the win. Can he close it out? Oh, did he get two and a half? I understand the sentiment, but now is not the time to bask in disbelief. AJ evades that one. Styles a fireman's carry. Fireman's carry neckbreaker. AJ not leaving anything up to chance against Balor at this point. I think we're gonna see it. Step through. Styles crash. Balor's in deep peril here. Two. He manages to kick out. What strength. Balor's arm shot up like a rocket after that two count. That was about as perfect a maneuver as you'll see from AJ Styles, and it still wasn't enough. Desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. Whoa, just floating through the air. All the momentum. Shoulders down! Life. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. AJ on the receiving end. Finn finding a way to slow his opponent's assault down. Finn showing it's not a time for lying down, it's a time for fighting back. Just one step ahead. Uh oh. What's it going to take to keep this guy? And this one is over. Let's take another look at what made that matchup so memorable. They say that iron sharpens iron, and AJ Styles can slice through just about anything after that one. Can't say enough about the fight that Finn Balor put up, but at the end of the day, there is simply only one phenomenal AJ Styles. Oh, Michael Corey, can you feel it? My veins are pulsating with positivity. Let's go. New Day rocks. Michael, New Day rocks. Corey? Shut up, Saxton. You know, the only thing worse than this pancake and unicorn parade is that I know for a fact these guys are going to launch their clothes at me. <laughs> Don't be a negative Nancy, Corey. That's just part of the fun. It's not fun. And they need to fire whoever's doing their laundry. Oh, look out, Corey, look out!
Say hello to Imperium. A united group with one unwavering mission to prove that the mat is sacred. Well, Imperium clearly are not here to have fun, but you have to respect their mission statement of the mat being sacred. Oh, I do, but I've seen your matches, Saxton, and you do not respect their mission statement. Have you seen my matches? I definitely consider the mat sacred. Oh, my gosh. He's undefeated. We are moments away from seeing Imperium's mission statement in action. And that's unfortunate for anyone else in the ring. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall and is for the World Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 417 pounds, Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston, the New Day. And their opponents at a combined weight 440 pounds. They are the World Tag Team Champions, Ludwig Kaiser and Giovanni Vinci. Imperia! So that's what it's all about, the tag team titles. Byron, I know you have a feeling in you. A feeling of power, perhaps? Uh, yeah, Michael. The power of positivity is in full effect, courtesy of the New Day. You know, nothing keeps these guys down. It's probably their best attribute as competitors. Very true. New Day does love to roll with the punches. They'll have a lot to roll with tonight. Each team looking to make an impact, looking to shake up the landscape of the tag team division. Well, I'll take it one step further, Saxton. These teams have a goal of dominating the division. Oh, man. Continually punishing, man. Not a whole lot you can do with a bum wing, guys. Enough already. And not a hair out of place as Ludwig salutes the crowd. Springboard misses the target. You hear the impact. The challenger eating up some damage. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. He went right into that turnbuckle. Knife edge chop. Oh, what a German suplex. He wasn't tough enough contending with one opponent. Now you got to deal with two. your perfect example for when you just want to put someone down with authority. These men knew this match is going to be hard fought. On the apron! The hardest part of the ring. 
After that attack on the apron, there is no way we're seeing them leave this arena without medical assistance. The challenger is not in a great place. And yeah, it's about time to heavily consider tagging in that partner. Sit up, powerbomb. Off into the pin. Powers through after two. That was a long two count there. the corner now. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. The buckle bomb into the Insiguri. And Vinci is keeping them to retain the title. And he stops the count for his partner. Vicious right forearm. And 
she gets that set right back to him. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. He turns it around. Looking worse for wear. There's the tag. Things are about to get worse for their opponent here. What kind of double team maneuver are we about to see? All the way up, uppercut into the power ball. But champions need to finish the job. Two. Things are getting risky. This will not end well. Champs, what a title defense. Tag teams always entertain, but the entertainment on that one was off the charts. time victory for this tag team here tonight. For my money, these two just might be the best tag team on the roster today. Make way for the Irish ace. This is going to be good. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Judgment Day. From Bray, County Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 180 pounds, J.D. McDonough. JD's recently proven very difficult to beat because of his incredible threshold for pain. Does this guy not freak you out? I mean, he signed an NXT Championship contract in blood. Uh, disturbing with a, a quiet intensity, right? Ferocious thoughts that will turn to disturbing actions. Yeah, those disturbing actions include dismantling the human body, utilizing pressure points, joint locks, and ligaments that can tear Tendon from bone. WWE Universe, let him talk to you. I think LA Knight may let his fists do the talking tonight. And his opponent from Hagerstown, Maryland, weighing in at 230 pounds, LA Knight. Movie star, good looks, charismatic as the day is long, and tough as nails. Well, I don't think anybody's going to argue the point that LA Knight is one of the most arrogant competitors in NXT history. I would agree with you, Saxton, but LA Knight has earned that arrogance with big wins over top talent. And now LA Knight is set to dominate all of WWE.
The smash mouth style of LA Knight should be on full display here tonight. Oh yeah, LA Knight calls himself the last of a dying breed and I have no doubt he's gonna show all these dummies in the crowd why that is. It's definitely not a pretty style, but it's effective. I mean, he'll be looking to find an answer for the Irish ace, J.D. McDonough. His unforgiving strikes and incredible Mac technique have put the WWE roster on notice. Yeah, Corey, not to mention his laser-like focus once he gets into the ring. J.D. McDonough is a fearsome opponent for any superstar. And you don't just do something like that to win a match. You do that to inflict punishment. What a clothesline! Ouch! What do we need to see from J.D. McDonough if he wants to come out on top in this match? We need to see McDonough putting his extensive knowledge of human anatomy to good use in systematically dissecting his opponent. McDonough has a rare talent for torturing the competition. The more he uses it, the better for him. That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. And he saw that coming from Knight. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Doom Buster! Chair. Uh oh! He deflects it right back. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Knight thinking high risk. Big boot. Jeez. JD cut open, but we've seen before that the Irish ace doesn't mind at all. He's starting to struggle here. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Back and forth from these competitors. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Two. L.A. Knight is showing his opponent takes a ride on the gravy train. Two. And a kick out. His opponent thought he had it in the bag for sure. This is when you have to switch game plans. You can't let yourself get discouraged. Listen, that from the middle rope. Oh, and he doesn't connect. Lands the knee. JD looking to hype himself up here. Okay. Cover here. And a kick out at two. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. what he deserves for all that gloating. Base Buster is unique. He's going for it all. A little heat seeking elbow. Is it enough? The cover. There's two. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. Oh, and a reversal. Seeing an answer for every move attempted. Striking. Power slam. Knight caught by surprise. And he said, you're not getting me with that this time. He's got him scouted. Swings up. Man, shoulder tackle. He's positioning himself, closing in. Hoist it up. Down. LA Knight making it look easy and painful at the same time. Not pretty at all. 
LA Knight kick to the gut. BFT. Knight about to end this fight. Two. And that's all she wrote. And here's another peek at some of the more memorable parts of the match. Here is your winner, L.A. Nice. Gressel, perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. Never a doubt. Barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. The following is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring, accompanied by MVP at a combined weight of 705 pounds. Omos and Zeus, the Hurt Business. The tag division has been extremely competitive as of late. Every duo looking to show why they run things around here. Here comes six foot eight, 385 pounds of chaos. And their opponents, first from Sheryls Ford, North Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds, Braun Strowman. Braun Strowman has a mean streak a mile long. Yeah, and a proven history of not playing well with others. because the monster is about to be unleashed. WWE Universe, brace for impact. We're about to see an air show. One of the best aerialists in WWE history. Exhilarating and inspiring. Yeah, one of the most gifted aerialists in our industry. You're right, Byron, but Ricochet knows flying around can only take you so far, which is why Ricochet also possesses a very impressive power game. Well, there is one guarantee. Ricochet knows how to captivate the WWE Universe.
So many successful Hall of Fame superstars originally started out in tag teams. Byron, think we might see the makings of a breakout performer here? Oh, there's definitely a chance, Michael. But it's just as likely that we see a team take that next step toward greatness. That's the beauty of tag team wrestling. You get to see superstars mature in all sorts of different ways. Uh-oh. Omas changes the direction of that one. Getting him into the corner. Makes him pay with a counter. Oh. <laughs> He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Oh, draping double axe handle. Stomping. Ouch. Delivers the headbutt. Right between the eyes. Just disrespectful. Oh, uh, stop right to the gut. Let him have this moment. He's earned it. Whitney Lariat. Ripped in the hard way. Planning on what to do next. Kick. Insulting. From the middle rope. Oh, what a splash! And this has got to be it! And a kick out by Strowman at two! I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Oh, and a wicked clothesline! Tagged in. Zeus has become relentless. Ricochet has to find energy fast. Kick to the gut. Big time hammer fist. This match grinded him down a little. Dodged right on cue. The springboard attack fails to land. the save. Stop dead in their tracks. It's over. Stop dead in their tracks. Choke slam. That's it. Zeus just ended things. Kick to the midsection. Could be uh -oh. What a match. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. He gets tagged in. A oh, club with a right forearm. Had that one scouted. And that failed to hit the mark. A little insult to your injury. And Ricochet getting completely grounded there. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. And he denies Omas. Brought in the hard way. Omas looking to end this. Choke slam. Oh, and a big boot. I don't know how there is anything left in these superstars' bodies. Yeah, the tank is being emptied tonight. No way. Oof! That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for their own well-being. Suplex! And now gets tossed into the ring. Yeah. Oh, Moss! Jack Knight Bob! Ricochet 
Ricochet fell that one big time. Makes the cover. And that will end it. And here's another quick look at those superstars in action in that tag team battle. Here are your winners, Zeus and Omos. The Hurt Business. Two great superstars that go great together, and that win is proof. Tag team excellence in its purest form. You simply love to see it, and I hope we see these guys tagging again real soon. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the SmackDown Women's Championship! Well, one of the most popular competitors in the women's division. We used to wonder if Liv Morgan could ever reach her potential. Well, she has done that and more. Yeah, who will ever forget when Liv Morgan won the Money in the Bank contract and managed to successfully cash it in on Ronda Rousey to win the SmackDown Women's Championship. Perhaps the best female high flyer in WWE, Io Sky. And you can never discount the backup, the control on the ground every time Io is around. Io Sky's list of titles in Japan is a mile long across every major women's division. Now here in WWE, Io has continued that success, but she has something now she didn't have then. She has control. Io Sky made her mark in NXT history as one of the most accomplished superstars in the brand's entire history. Yeah, but Io's change in attitude and her new allies ensure even more success in WWE. Introducing the challenger from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan! And her opponent from Tokyo, Japan, she is the SmackDown Women's Champion, Io Sky! Anticipation building to see who will leave tonight as SmackDown Women's Champion. And almost everyone who holds the SmackDown Women's title has managed to make it their own and bring a special something to their reign. That's right, this title is an opportunity to change the perception of being a champion. Someone will get that chance tonight. And some effective offense with that one. Into the knee drop. And 
into the count. She kicks out in one. Starting to see the tolls of this match add up. Reversal from Morgan. Quick exchange of counters there. Ooh! The genius of the sky showing off a little bit for the folks on the ground. Morgan timed that one well. Corey, if you're EO Sky, how do you go about trying to capture the win here? You know what, Cole? I'd try to be as unpredictable as possible. When it comes to EO, every opponent's obviously going to expect aerial attacks, so she's got to mix it up. Try a variety of offensive maneuvers. Keep them guessing. Oh, quite an effective counter. Oh, a dragon screw ankle breaker. Wow, that hurt. About to be the proverbial one-legged man in the you-know-what kicking contest. The challenger's looking shaken. Oh, my gosh, what impact. From the top, elbow drop. Goes into the pin and a shoulder in the air. She just shocked everyone in the ring. An agile escape. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Forearm smash. And Eo gets reversed. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. Going counter for counter. Now can it be capitalized on? Boom, what a roundhouse. <laughs> what a forearm. She is in a precarious position. Looking to inflict even more damage. Now it's gonna get ugly and gonna get bad up to the top row. Wait, wait a second, wait a second! Spanish fly, my goodness! Pin attempt for the championship. A kick out at two. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Oh! EO with a turnaround. Chop block. Brilliant. Right to the back of the knee. Liv Morgan needs to figure this out. This is an intelligent play by EO. Mixing up her offense, staying unpredictable. Over the moonsault by EO Sky. I think the champ's got it. Oh, she kicked out. Somehow, this title is still up for grabs. Now might be a good time to regroup. Rethink your plan. I don't think Io is going to let that kick out phase her. If anything, it added fuel to her fire. No way! Suicide dive! That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. Io is completely dictating the pace here. Io has everything going how she wants it. Io Sky, double underhook, and driven down with a face buster. If this works, it could change the course of the match. She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. Here we go again. Moonsault connects. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. Retains the title. Let's look back on the action from the last match. Here's your winner, and still the SmackDown Women's Champion, EO Sky. What an emphatic victory, guys. No contest. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was as one-sided as it gets.
The following contest is in elimination match. Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, CM Punk. The WWE Universe more than ready to see this one start. This is going to be good. A very high pressure situation ahead for this guy, but he is more than ready for it. Guys, we're about to see a fight. I've been waiting a long time for this. opponents first representing the brawling brutes from dublin ireland weighing in at 267 pounds the celtic warrior sheamus a superstar who's seen and done it all in wwe but will never say no to a fight man who betrayed Drew McIntyre, Cesaro, and the entire WWE Universe. Well, luckily, the Irishman's powerful enough to fight all on his own. Decade atop WWE with the accolades to prove it. And from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth Freaking Rollins. He's arrogant, he's abrasive, but he's also really freaking good. And he has the titles and main events to prove it. That's it. And the WWE Universe serenading Rollins with his battle hymn. Time for Seth freaking Rollins to conduct another masterpiece. And you've got to come into this triple threat with a different mindset than any other match. Well, contending with multiple opponents really makes you think in a cerebral manner. Do you focus on one opponent or wait for an opening and capitalize? Lots of ways to approach this fight. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent and tossing them aside. German suplex released. A match like this can have so many twists and turns, Corey. What will have an impact on this matchup? You need to strike first. Dictate the pace of the match. Since anything goes, you can add anything to the equation. Each competitor responds differently to the rules being thrown out the window. The key is who can stay alert and remain in control. I wish someone would throw you out a window. Next breaker excellently executed. Placed into the corner. 
Uh-oh, this is not watch your face. Imported Alabama slam. Seth Rollins feeling the effects right now. Shiny wizard action. A bulldog! Boom! Oh, what a kick to the face! Oh my God! Don't do it! Suicide dive! Whatever it takes to win. Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke and it pays off. Oh, what a DDT! Wow! And he gets set back into the ring. On the apron. Oh, God! Caught with the lariat. Check out the springboard. He right to the midsection. Setting them up for the Falcon Arrow. Oh, misses the mark. He fends off the attack. Boom, nice. Rollins has him up. Falcon arrow. And he's taking this to the outside now. This could do it. Forces the shoulder up after two. A long two and a half in the waning moments of this match. Seth Rollins. Oh, what a super kick from the architect. He's taking some good hits. And he's able to reverse. Right to the chest and then the throat. Wicked. He's been placed in the corner now. Rollins got surprised there. Oh, man, that was nasty. Oh, right to the throat. Oof. Slips out of the way there. What reflexes? Answering back. He's headed up top. Thinking big. Perched up top, almost lost her balance, but regained it, misses! It's a rather crude facial reconstruction. That's not very nice. Face gouge! Oh, God! That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Rollins with a reversal. Rollins knows just what he needs to do to end this. Oh, launching himself in the ropes. Oh! Oh, it's not gonna be, uh-oh! Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Whatever you can do, I can do better. Counters on top of counters. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Something's about to go either very wrong or very right. Impressive reversal up high. Crossbody from the top. Looking for the victory. Two. No, stops the count at two. What do you have? Break that up. Counters that. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Not gonna be good. What noise, what impact. He leaves the ring and there's no count outs in this one. Oh, there's the Irish curse backbreaker. And the pro kick. No doubt. Shane has ended this. He kicks out somehow. Where in the world is he getting? Well, he thinks he has it. Hit. What a kick out in two. What a kick. Oh, that's not going to be. Uh-oh. Sheamus denies the attack. He gets out of the way. You have to sense that fatigue is starting to become a factor at this point. Make no illusions of it. This is coming down to a battle of attrition. Gosh, what a match. Oh, he retaliates. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Outright presentation of power there. The architect going to have to design a counter to this submission maneuver. Rollins better design it quick. Time is running out. A couple of knees there. That'll get him out of it. Big 
bar. Oh, Seth Rollins. Game over. Cover. Two. Oh, and a kick out. Kicked out. He kicked out. Thought he had it. You got to be kidding me. Inside cradle. Oh, look at this small package. Oh, but how? How? Oh, what a clubbing blow. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. Oh, God, that hurt. He's able to sidestep there. Oh, it's not going to be pretty. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. Sheamus is in crisis mode. And Sheamus, Sheamus is eliminated. Has been eliminated. Determination in his eyes, and now a kendo stick in his hands. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Nice calf kick. Great elevation. Single leg drop kick caught him. Oh, just gouging the face. That's not right. Oh, that didn't go as set design. Oh, a step up in Zagari. <laughs> oh, what a punch. And gets tossed back into the mat. Off the turnbuckles. What's he going to do? Lost their balance, but regained it. He misses the target. Short flight, but a rough landing. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Oh, it's not going to be pretty. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. The, the pay window beckons. And he's still in the game. Rollins staying in this thing. Some could even say he's far too stubborn to have things end like that. And it's going to take composure now. Could just need one more big move. The admiration for... Here it comes! The stop connects! It is all Rollins now! Kick out! I thought it was finished off for sure. I truly thought it was all over there. Talk about resilience. Yeah, but did you see how the referee had to get into position? That was all the difference. Seth Rollins in deep thought, hoping to conjure from behind. Oh, boy. Shoulders down. I hold the win. Oh, and he kicked out at two. I cannot believe it. A oh, jumping knee strike. Lights out. He's turning the tables. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. Boom! Small package driver. Ooh! Ball is just a step too slow. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. What more can this superstar do? Reaching deep into the arsenal. This could end the entire match. From the top floor, set for the ride through the table. Pure chaos. Cover here. And here's another peek of the moves he saw in that match. Here is your winner, CM Punk. Quite the performance from all three superstars in this match.
I cannot even imagine how any of these men feel after a match like that. All I can really say is that they put on a triple threat match for the ages. A man, an animal, who has done it all in WWE. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal, Batista! A multiple-time World Heavyweight Champion, a Royal Rumble winner, Batista has earned his spot atop WWE. A founding member of Evolution, but the animal himself has evolved to the top of the food chain in this industry. Is he ready to face the showstopper, the icon, the main event, the heartbreak kid? We're about to find out. Mr. WrestleMania, the showstopper, and his opponent from San Antonio, Texas, weighing in at 227 pounds, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. Ladies and gentlemen, there is a reason that this man's nickname is Mr. WrestleMania, one of the greatest performers in the history of WWE. After missing nearly four years with a severe back injury, some doubted we would ever see Michaels in WWE again. Yeah, here's the thing, Corey. After returning, some say Shawn Michaels is better now than he's ever been. Certainly a hard point to argue. One of the greatest of all time, Mr. WrestleMania. Shawn Michaels is fed up with the disrespect he's receiving from younger members of the WWE locker room. There was a time in HBK's career where he was brash and not on many people's Christmas card list, but he didn't care then what people thought, and he shouldn't care now either. Either way, Michaels is looking to straighten things out right now. And we know Batista is powerful, but can that power last for the duration of the match? Batista is an insane specimen, Saxton, an altered beast who is as ferocious as ever. I would never bet against the animal's capabilities. Ooh, again! Dropkick on target! Able to get the advantage here. Dominating shoulder tackle. Power slam. Batista getting the WWE Universe riled up. Fist to the 
skull. From behind. Nick Breaker. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Into the pay window. Kick it out before the count. Wow. I thought for sure that was it. Michaels putting it all on the line. From the top. Saw what was coming and turned it into a backbreaker of their own. Put it in position now. Right on their face. Oh, look at this here, guys. Look at this. Back suplex into a powerball. My goodness. That'll hurt. DDT. Thrown back in under the ropes. is why he's destroyed the career of the superstars. Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. From the ground up. Power slam. Elbow drop. Piercing. Disheartening position for HBK. Batista pacing off with this offense. The animal keeping himself from getting carried away. Good chance for Michaels to regain some composure. Big four. Batista able to counter. Up and around and down. Right. To the corner. This can't be good. Guys, I can't think of a worse place for him to be right now. The animal is firing. Climbing up top. Look at the blows to the back of the neck and a back superplex. And this is going to be it. Oh, my God. That was so close. What an incredible match we are witnessing. Oh, that kick will stop me in your tracks. Oh, man. Michael saves himself. Barely evades a stalemate of counters. Batista with the Batista bite. I have no idea how he hasn't tapped out yet. All oh, the heart. Oh. oh, look at oh man. One blow, all it took. Coming. 
If Batista just survived the best shot he's going to receive all night, I don't think there's any... victory no doubt it was a good one here's another look here is your winner the animal Batista's got to be feeling good about this performance tonight hey Batista earned it in every sense of the word Batista with a hurtful purpose. Uh-oh. Batista setting him up. It could be time. A Batista bomb! The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring from Kyoto, Japan. Weighing in at 220 pounds, Shinsuke Nakamura. The WWE Universe already reaching a fever pitch upon their arrival, and we are just seconds away from a highly anticipated match. Look at the focus and drive in his eyes. Ready to prove he's the best this division has to offer. Doomsday has arrived. It was only a matter of time. Tick tock.
And gentlemen, I'm afraid time has just run out for the entire WWE locker room. An all-time WCW and WWE great. From Houston, Texas, weighing in at 251 pounds, Booker T. Booker T, he says to gain respect, you got to earn respect. Well, Booker T has lived by that motto, which is why he is a two-time WWE Hall of Famer and one of the most decorated athletes the industry has ever known. There is no one quite like Booker T. Hey, Byron, can you dig it? Sucker! Oh, 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 my throat. Cody Rhodes has returned. A man who changed the entire wrestling world and is now ready to prove himself again in the WWE. forget the night that you and I had the opportunity to call this man's amazing return to WWE. You're right about that, Saxton. A true WrestleMania moment, if there ever was one. Certainly an accomplished career his first time around. Well, many would say this version of Cody Rhodes is completely transformed and set to take over the main event picture of WWE. Each pinfall narrows the field in this elimination match, but here at the start we see Shinsuke Nakamura, Karrion Cross, Booker T, and Cody Rhodes. This is where I would just hang back and let everyone else rip each other to shreds, stay out of sight and out of mind, then come in and pick the meat off the bones. He had it scouted. Oh, what a knee strike. This is not going to end well. Crash landing, powerball. Oh, put down face first. Overhand connects. Strikes with a kick. Any superstar has the odds against them entering a fatal four-way. What's the best way to overcome those odds, Corey? Well, there's a few options, Cole. You can lay in wait for a moment to capitalize, or you can power through and take everyone on head first. The most important part is breaking up any pinfalls or submissions. Uh-oh, position in. Measuring. In. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Ouch. Whoa, not 
quite yet. Oh, right to the throat. And, and come on, was that really... Punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. Uh-oh, position in. Measuring. Oh, well placed knee drop of a skull. Blatant disregard for their opponent. The final cut. Perfectly executed. Kick out just before two. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. Oh. Step up, but effective. Bam! Step kick. Ooh. And he denies Cody. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Rose looking to end this. Rose just turned the lights on. Inhuman at this point. Tough position to be caught in here. Oh, not a power ball off to the apron. Springboard drop kick. That's gotta be it. He got the shoulder up in time. We are this far into the match. Where is this energy coming from? Thunderous club comes down. Very effective. Fails to connect on the springboard. Way to get out of harm there. Oh, oh, smash! Oh! Nakamura not shaken one bit by the presence of his opponent. On the shoulders and a slam! Is it enough? The cover! Kicks out. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. And Cody Rhodes reverses. Cody Rhodes. Shinsuke ready to get lethal on his opponent. Ah, oh, jeez. Booker T has to find a way to get back on offense. This is bad. Yeah, this is not good. You don't say, Saxton. Booker T is getting taken out to the woodshed here. Now is not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. These superstars have endured so much punishment. Certainly looking worse for wear, but the tide can shift at any moment. Rhodes about to head to the pay window. Oh, Karrion looks out of it. Looking for the victory. Two count. And Cross is over. He's eliminated. eliminated. Up and down. What a slam. Sucked all the air out of this place. It looked like a done deal. Shinsuke hoists him up. Uh-oh. Rhodes tied that one. What's he open to find out there? A hockey stick? The goon was not to the Cody Rhodes has his opponent referee wants a crossroads. Cody Rhodes just might have finished things. Shoulder up before three. Wow, looks like this book has a couple more chapters. Whoa! Suicide dive! Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Oh, a springboard roundhouse. And Booker T getting worked on right now. Can Booker withstand this surge against him? Rhodes from the middle rope. He eludes the contact. Ooh, man. He knew what was coming there. Ducking out of trouble. Kick to the midsection. Booker take. Axe kick. Can you dig it, Saxton? Serious jeopardy for Rhodes. Two. Wow, just barely making it out. Cody Rhodes with a defiant kick out. Simply refusing to stay down. And now the question runs in the mind, how am I going to be able to end this? Elbow drop. The piercing. Shifts it back onto him. Strong oh. kick. My goodness. Oh, hold on. One-handed. Kinshasa. It's all Shinsuke now. Resilient 
that's on display from Cody Rhodes is a common occurrence that never gets old. But Nakamura will have to remain unflappable and continues his assault to end this. He may get the three count right here. I think so. And he fights it off. You got a question. How much is it worth? How much is it worth to continue through the agony? It's obviously worth everything. Obviously worth every drop of sweat on the ground. Ooh. Gets out of dodge. Oh, a roundhouse kick. Shoulders down. What? You gotta be kidding me. He kicked out. He actually kicked out. Does he have him here? No. Kick out of two. Good lord. Scarily close to three. Punch straight to the face. Stays off the attack. Both superstars showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. He just bit. He shoots out. Nakamura. Nakamura right on target. There's two. No, my, that was close. The American Nightmare able to persevere here. Absolutely incredible. And you have to wonder if Nakamura can pull off one more big hit to finally get the win. Big four. for Nakamura. Sense the desperation mounting as that left middle rope missile drop kick with the target. Oh my gosh! And Booker T is having his way right now. An unrelenting Booker T here. Nakamura style on display. It finds a counter. Big four. Ooh, walloped by a huge club. Booker off the ropes. Scissors kick. You gotta love it. Will that clinch things for Booker? Two count. There it is. Booker T gets it. And here's another look at why the Fatal Four Way is one of the most unpredictable and entertaining matches in WWE. Superstar who beat the numbers game here tonight. That might have been one of the most entertaining fatal four ways we've ever seen. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Championship! Well, the chance of all before the Goldberg Storm. And what a storm it promises to be. Moments 
away from an explosion of offense from Goldberg. One of the driving forces behind WCW's success, former WCW champion. A man who absolutely bleeds intensity. Beyond the WCW championship, Goldberg's a two-time United States champion, one-time WCW tag team champion. Oh, and by the way, a WWE Universal Champion. Multiple WCW titles, multiple WWE titles, multiple Universal titles. And to this very day, a man whose name is always in the championship conversation. The Hall of Famer has arrived. Here comes the Austrian anomaly, Gunther. A man with one purpose, to prove the math sacred. <laughs> the ring general has declared the mat sacred and sees this industry as pure sport meaning there is no room for games and antics a good there takes everything so seriously like he's always scowling hey listen he takes pride in what he does it's difficult not to admire the expertise possessed by gunther gunther is so unflinching as if nothing phases him the man's impervious to distraction because he's constantly focused on the task at hand. Yeah, it's like watching a machine. Introducing the challenger. From Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 270 pounds, Goldberg! And his opponent, from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, he is the WWE Champion, Gunter! It is the richest prize our industry has to offer. This is the WWE Championship. championship in professional wrestling and tonight we may see a new chapter in its storied history both champion and challenger are motivated by the biggest prize of them all the man who lays claim to that title can call himself the very best competitor in this industry release german snap power slam gunther able to steer clear fights that off reciprocating the initial reversal uncorks a thunderous chop Corey Goldberg is perpetually in the attack position is that the approach that will bring him the victory tonight tonight Goldberg needs to take an extra second to think before he makes a move given the force and rate of propulsion in Goldberg's offense one mistake could take him out of the match for good Still 
all in sight. He can't let that discourage him. He's got to keep on the offensive. He got whipped into that corner. Dominating shoulder tackle. Turnbuckle drop kick. And that stops whatever Goldberg had intended. Oh, and a wicked clothesline. Here's the pin. Title on the line. And the champ only gets a count of one. This isn't even close to over. Ooh. Carefully measured knee strikes. Relenting with these knee strikes. Shot to the chest. Oh, God. Knife edge chop. From the apron. Great counter. Impressive ring IQ on display there. Precarious position for both superstars. Oh, gosh. A back suplex right out of the apron. The apron can do some serious damage. It might be worse than being hit with a steel chair. The champ getting put to the test here. Oh, target acquired and destroyed. All the way up, and the big time powerbomb. A powerbomb is not meant to be pretty, but oh man, does it get the job done. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't want to be taking any more of those. Shot after shot, oh, ruthless striking. Goldberg is completely off the leash. Goldberg's going full force, but is keeping just enough of an even keel to avoid making mistakes. Rolling knee bar! An extreme amount of pressure. Boot to the face will free him. Vicious right forearm. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. just can't seem to stop this offense. Gunther is being subjugated to a beatdown. Gunther quick to the counter. Gunther showing he's not out of it. Gunther could be turning his fortunes around. Oh, Bob! Covered by the champ! I thought Goldberg was done for sure. Oh, so close. Disbelief on the face of the champion. They both know what's at stake. Neither competitor is going to lose easy here. It is just unbelievable. And Guther's tank has got to be running low, guys. I don't know what his game plan is now. This deep into a match is where trouble rises, where injuries may occur. You've got to think long term and consider your future fights. And I guarantee you that throwing in the towel is the furthest thing these superstars are thinking about. Rumbling. Perfect time to attack when his guard is down. He catches Guther with a big counter. Showtime? Oh no! All the way up. Ow! <laughs> Gotta find a way to get out of this. My And he slides him back to the mat. Now a pin for the championship. One, two, no, title still hangs in the balance. This 
is going to come down to who wants it more. He knew that was coming. Oh, close line. Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. Kick. It's the mark. This is the mark. All right, pump handle. Pump handle coming. Boom. Incredible suplex. Boom. Running FTO plants him. Nicely done. Striking at will. There are no words for the ride these fans have gone through in this match. It has been a roller coaster, and I don't think the ups and downs are over yet. Great wherewithal from Goldberg. Delivering. Here's the pin to retain. Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. I am shaking my head in disbelief over how he managed to get the shoulder up. He steers clear of contact. Close line. Oh, I had that well scouted. Oh, look at close line. Covered by the champ. Oh, what a kick out. The muscle memory's got to be taken over now. Pure instinct to kick out before three. Long fall and even harder impact. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Ooh -hoo. Gunther put a stop to that. Knife edge chop. Oh, that'll keep Goldberg at bay. Run out of ringside and back to the mat. Gunther looking to attack from above. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. From the heavens. Splash from the top. Is it enough? The cover. Two. He refuses to stay down. Pure instinct. Able to evade. Goldberg with a spear for the championship. <laughs> Emphatic kick out from the champion. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. How in the world do these superstars have anything left at this point? There he is perched up top. Uh-oh. And able to counter. Uh-oh. Thunderous power bomb. The champ has this one in hand now. Uh-oh. Thunderous power bomb. A championship level move. Champ will stay champ. Makes the cover. What a win. Gunther is still your champion. Let's take a little look at some of the action from that match. Wow. Here's your winner, and still, the WWE Champion, Gunter! This is the type of victory where you really have to weigh the cost against the benefits. Oh my God, Goldberg loses! 
It happened when he became 173 and 1, and it happened again tonight. I can't believe it.